Hey everyone, it's me Jerome Style. Welcome to another new video. You know, I thought I'd do one a little bit, a video about Calgary. I haven't done one in a while and I thought I'd do one on something that really, really pisses me off. <laughs> and what I'm talking about is this big, this big blue circle. Now, tax dollars paid for this circle here. It's an art project that overlooks uh, the Deerfoot here. So the Deerfoot, for those who are not familiar, is the major highway in Calgary. The Queenie Elizabeth, Queen Elizabeth uh, Road here, QE2, uh, it heads up to Edmonton up north. Um, it's a major, major road. And I drive up and down this road every single day for work. And I see this big blue hula hoop with two awkwardly placed lights on top <laughs> and yeah I absolutely hate the thing and the reason why I hate this thing so much is because it's an ice but also because of the cost and how much do you think this thing costs now it's a big giant blue circle so uh, as far as I understand it's about 17 meters high and it's supported by four kind of rings at the bottom of the base and apparently it's some kind of you know engineering feat to be able to have this big blue circle supported by four little I don't know supports on the bottom there anyways this circle <laughs> I mean it's art and it was chosen by a panel of, of supposedly five people and they, there was a, there's about 55 submissions for art for the this bridge right here, and they chose one. It's it's a German designer. It's called Traveling Light. Um, <laughs> so, all right, I just like to see a big blue circle with lights on top. That looks so stupid. Anyways, let's just cut to the chase. So, the, what do you think the price is on this thing? Now, if I was to look at this circle, this big circle, I would say, okay, you know what, maybe 10 grand. But, you know, when you think about, okay, well, there's some manpower involved and, you know, it's art, so art's always a little more expensive than you think, especially with the city. Okay, let's be fair. Let's say this circle costs maybe fifty to $55,000. I would say that is a pretty good price. You know, to be fair for this. <laughs> okay, well actually the real price is $471,000. Do you see anything like awesome about this? You got the Deerfoot, thousands of th upon thousands of people driving up this road, seeing this monstrosity of 55 submissions how bad were the other 54? <laughs> this big blue ass hula hoop with the stupid lights above it is $471,000 of taxpayer money. So I, people are outraged with this thing. I'm outraged. I mean, I am all for public art for, you know, I love seeing art in Calgary. It, it makes our city better. I mean, any city with art, it makes it better. But like, I mean, I'm not opposed to this being here if it was not so bloody expensive. It's just 400, almost $500,000 for this thing. Oh, so I, don't, I really don't get how we were able to let this pass. Um, this is just a big giant waste of taxpayer money. It is just, it's just an eyesore. I, when I first saw this, this is Airport Trail or 96th Avenue. So um, it connects to the air, uh, it's a main road now connecting to the, to easy access to the airport. And I thought when <laughs> this bridge was being built, I thought this was a giant coil of like pipe or electrical wire or something. I just saw this big giant circle. I'm like, oh, they must be need a lot of wire or something. <laughs> and then, well, once I found out, no, this is art. 
So, yeah, that's uh, that's it. See those four little supports there holding it? Yeah, look at that engineering feat. You know, $471,000. Oh, there's a light source up there. Oh, there's electrical power through this thing. Oh, $471,000. <laughs> so I think this thing is completely stupid. Uh, the mayor said this was disgusting. Um, yeah, I just I hope in the future we can have more than five people deciding what the rest of Calgary and people who come from Empton or other areas outside that come to our great city and see this eyesore. So, yes, things need to change. This is completely stupid. Uh, big hula hoop with lights on top of it. And it's blue. whip de frickin' do So here we are, up close. Here's the four powerful, uh, you know, connecting pieces that hold this thing up. I mean, it's cool. I get it. It's a big circle. Being supported by these four pieces here but wow all right and you know what's even the cool part about it if you want to see at nighttime we got three lights here to make sure you can see the thing at night you know we got the lights above we got the lights below yeah you know we got calgary seeing every single little bit of this circle ah four hundred and seventy one thousand dollars Woo! <laughs> Anyways, I thought I'd share this this monstrosity of an art piece. Art subjective, but I mean, honestly, when you put a giant price tag on this, it's not worth it. We could have done so much better. I mean, you could have represented something a little bit more with Calgary or a, let's say the mountains that were nearby or a river, you know, the, the Bow River, Elba River, foothills, something. I know we got a big circle. 55 people came up with something. This is the best we could come up with. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, so, yeah, I'll catch you guys later. And hopefully, if there's another art project, it'll be something better than this. Oh, anyways, I'll catch you guys later. Ciao.